Before we go into it and you're going more into this logic, let's walk them through. Okay. With Christopher. So we've met, we've met at, at Panera. We've met at Panera. First thing I do is I'm going to say, excuse, Chris, would you do me a favor? Chris, would you do me a favor? I'm just going to pick Chris because I can't say Christopher, Chris, and Drew. Although he wants to. <laughs> Chris, would you do me a favor and just fill out this shopping survey? What I like to do is we're an internet marketing company and product brokerage, but we do track consumer spending. So would you just take a second and, and check off everything you use on this home shopping list? And I will hand that to him. At that time, I'll set up my computer. I'm going to set up my computer now. Should have told me to bring the prop. I had home shopping list. <laughs> I set up. So now we're going to go through the, the portal tour. I've got... So I take Chris's home shopping list and set it aside. Thank you, Chris. I appreciate Thanks, Chris. that. Thanks, Chris. Thanks, Christopher. Thanks, Chris. So me and you are sitting there. Say, let's... It's hard for me to do this without... Just say, Chris. Yeah. Chris. Chris. <laughs> We're going to get started now. So, Chris, would you agree that um, a lot of money is being made online, but most people don't know how it really all works? Yes. Where is Chris? Right there. Thank you. Right here. Now i got somebody to look at. Chris, you're my man. <laughs> <laughs> and you're not alone. Most people, we all know there's a lot of money being made online, but we don't know exactly how it's done. So let me explain it for a minute. Where do you get your email right now? Like, do you use Yahoo or Gmail or one of those services? Most people do. They use Yahoo, AOL. I use Yahoo. So let's use, I, I'll just click on Yahoo right here. So you set that service, whatever it might be. They're all basically the same. Facebook, Yahoo, AOL, MSN. And you go here primarily to check your mail. Do the other things you would do online. If it came up here, that would work beautifully. But so you go there, check your mail, get the news, and then go wherever you go online. Fair, fair to say? And at the end of the month, they mail you a check, right? Oh, they don't? I'm just kidding. They don't, but they should. Because every time you go on this site that you can see up here that's not up here that has advertising and stuff on it, there's advertising on it. So we'll just pretend there's advertising here. This is the problem when you have technology. It can work or it cannot. But here's the funny thing. If this will happen, just as, let's start over. This will happen sometimes to you. Don't get flustered about it. Just start over, click on it, and keep going. There, and everything gets fixed magically. <laughs> so the reason I mention that, they don't pay you, but they really should. Because every time you go on this site to check your mail on this free service, look what's sitting over here. There's advertising, and you can use Facebook, any of them. They're all the same. These advertisers love this form of advertising, and there's a reason. The way they used to do advertising was primarily television. Would, we, would you agree with me? And, the, and the re, what they did was they created an ad campaign, pump it out on TV, and hope for a 4 or 5% return on their investment. Recently, about two to three years ago, something changed. A little thing called TiVo and DVR came out, where now everyone records their favorite shows, they come home late at night, and what do they do to the commercials? Skip through them. They fast forward right through them. These advertisers and stores had to switch over to this form of advertising because this form of advertising actually makes more sense for them. For one reason, nobody's watching commercials anymore, right, Chris? They, don't, they just don't watch them. You just told me that. You're absolutely right. They don't. They, they fast forward through them. They come home late at night. They watch their shows. They're not watching commercials. But there's also another reason they like this so much. When Yahoo, in this case, can tell that advertiser, Exactly how many millions of people are looking at that ad every second during the day? Because they know if that's in front on your computer, you're looking at it. Would you agree? So they, they know this. So they can tell that, that advertiser exactly how many people are looking at that. And if people click on it, they get paid even more money. They're making millions and now hundreds of millions and now billions of dollars in advertising revenue this way. And here's the funny thing. The stores actually love it. Because Lowe's, Home Depot, Victoria's Secret, whatever, Dick's Sporting Goods, whatever, they advertise on these forms of affiliate marketing. They don't have to pay until after someone purchases the product. So when they use, you go to Amazon, they don't get paid. So they now get 100% return on their advertising dollar. This is why everything's switching over. So it's kind of a win-win-win situation. The difference is at Yahoo, Amazon, Facebook, Gmail, AOL, whatever you use, they keep all the money. At, at, at shop.com, we're a similar program, but we're actually going to let you sign up, use it for free. There's no cost to use this. But now every time you go here and shop, you're going to get paid cash back. And we're going to create a cash back account. You can see right here, I happen to have my wife signed in as a customer. Because not only do I own this site, but I also use it as a customer. So I earn cash back too. So you can see we've got $126.08 there. Um, that's free money on things we were going to buy anyways, because we earn cash back, but we also get paid commissions for driving this. 
But the beauty of this is we don't make the money off the customers, for, off of you using this free site. We make our money off the advertisers and the retail stores. They're willing to pay us to drive your traffic to them, and we're willing to share some of that money back with you. So you're going to get a cheaper, better deal through us than going directly to the store, and I'll show you how that works. But we're also not naive. I know that if you're used to using Amazon, you know, I got to give you some reasons to switch. Is that fair to say? Okay, say I'm with you. I get it. I'm with you, man. <laughs> so here's the neat thing about this. This is an evolving brand new program. We're working with Microsoft, and we're showing, we're, we're creating some, not cutting edge technology. Some of this stuff's never been done before. So we've got some really neat things I just want to show you. We've got a little tab here called e-gifts. Now what's an e-gift? This is revolutionizing gift giving. Imagine if you can come here and create what we call an e-gift. Maybe you've got an aunt or a sister who lives in Florida, and her name's Mary, and it's Mary's birthday, and you want to give Mary a gift. Traditionally, you'd go to the store, maybe find something you think she might like or whatever, a gift card or whatever, and mail it to her and hope it gets there and hope she likes it. With e-gifts, you can go on here and create what we call an electronic gift. Because under this umbrella of shop.com, we, we have thousands and thousands and thousands of partner stores like Best Buy, Target, Walmart, Kmart, Kohl's, you, you name it, they're partnered with us. So now you can go shopping at any number of different stores, choose items you think she might like, and add them to what we call an e-gift. And maybe pick 20, 25 items from any number of different stores. You can instantly email it to Mary in Florida, and when it gets there, she opens it up and it says, Happy birthday, Mary. I wasn't sure what to get you, but here's 25 items I thought you might like. She doesn't see the price of the item. She just sees a picture and a description of the item. She now clicks on the item she likes the best. That store drop ships it to Mary in Florida and bills your debit or credit card. <laughs> Virtually giving you the ability to personalize the gift. You never had to leave your laptop or computer to do it, and Mary actually got something she liked for a change. So this is revolutionizing gift giving. Just some neat technology I wanted to show you. It's patented technology, nobody else has it. We can also do the same thing with gift registries, and it's gonna, pretty soon we're gonna do it with all thousands of stores, where you'll be able to create a gift registry at one spot. You'll be able to go in, choose items from any number of different stores, and put them on one bridal registry or one baby shower registry. So you're not limited to one or two stores, and that's gonna be powerful too. Just some revolutionary technology. But what I really like, Chris, is the ability that we have to comparative shop. Because let me ask you a question. Let's say you were in the market for a new TV. Okay, what would your process be to go purchase that TV if you're going to go out and get one this week? I would bounce around in stores. And, and compare prices, right? And figure out which one you wanted and then try and get the cheapest price, right? I mean, we probably all do the same thing. That's what I would do. That's what Yardley would do. That's, Absolutely. That's what we want. Everybody shops to get the, the best price. So let's say we're looking for a new smart TV because we want to get a computerized TV or something. You want to upgrade. So you, you go in here and let's just do a generic search for, let's say, a 50 inch. Smart TV. So I type it in, and let's just do a generic search. If I knew the model and the brand, I could put that in, but we'll just search for a, a TV. So we want to buy a smart TV, so let's click on this one. As soon as I click on that TV, our site goes out and searches thousands of stores under this umbrella of shop.com and brings back all the best prices. So let me ask you a question, Chris. Which would you rather pay, $13.99 or $747? $747. <laughs> So would I. We all would, right? And the beauty of this is, what you got to understand is, we're, we don't care. It might sound bad, but we don't care what store you buy it from. No matter which store you pick, we want you to get the best price. We don't make our money off you. We're going to make our money off the store. So you save money, and we make money. And the beauty of it is, also, on the top of it, let's say you even knew my gopher was the cheapest place to go and you knew to go there, it would still make more sense to come here first because you're going to get the $16 cash back the next day when you come back here in your cash back account. So even if you knew about my gopher as that store, you wouldn't have gotten that $16 we're willing to pay you after you make that purchase. And it's a win-win-win situation for the stores because it doesn't matter which store you pick, they don't pay us anything until after that purchase is made. That TV's left their warehouse, then they pay us, and we share part of it back with you. Win-win-win. So every, there's no losers in this. That's, that's the beauty of it. Another great thing is this comparative shopping technology is relatively new. What do you think happens when all these retailers are realizing with one click of a button you get to compare all their prices if they want to stay competitive? What, what, what has to happen? Price will come down. 
drives down the price. You're absolutely right. That's exactly right. The price is going to go down. So for us as consumers, because Yarly, you and I, Chris, we all buy stuff. The, for us as consumers, it just makes more sense because all we care about is volume and driving traffic. The stores are willing to pay us, so we save money. The, we, the business owners are on these sites make money, and even the stores are happy because they don't pay anything out. They get 100% return on their advertising. But let's say, Chris, you want that TV because you want that, that, that particular brand, but $747 is more than you want to spend. Let's say your budget for a TV is $650 or something. Here's something nobody else has. You can go in here and click on set price alert and just click that little tab. And now you can type in $650 here because it says notify me when the price is less than or equal to whatever you want to pay. And you can type in $650 and then put in your email address and hit submit. Every day for the next 60 days, we will search every store that carries that TV. And when we find it on sale, we'll send you an email alert saying, hey, we just found that TV you wanted at XYZ store. Would you be interested in purchasing it for 650 or less? Virtually giving you a personal shopper that will shop for you 24 hours a day for any price you want to pay. Would you, would you agree people would use a service like that? Yep. They would. I agree too, because I, I do use it and it works. It's fantastic. So let me show you something else. And if you wanted, if you clicked on the store here, let's just click on the store. Sears, let's say you wanted to buy it at Sears instead. When you click on it, you're being redirected to Sears. You're not buying that TV from me. You're buying it from your favorite store that you choose. You're buying it from Sears. And as soon as you go to Sears site, a little thing called Shop Buddy now is going to pop up. Now what's Shop Buddy? When you get home today, what I want you to do, if nothing else, remember this is free for you to use this. There's no cost. You simply go on here and download Shop Buddy on your browser. It just pops, sits there in the browser. It's not even downloaded on your computer. It's a browser download. Now when you open that up, every promo code that, that, Sear, that Sears has out today pops up here. Because let me ask you, have you ever shopped online for anything and at checkout it says enter promo code? And you don't have one? Ticks you off, doesn't it? <laughs> You're not alone, me too. That'll never happen again. Because this is a free service. Again, would you agree you would use something like this? That's all we're trying to show you. It's neat technology, and the beauty of it is it's free. There's no cost to use this. You simply download it and use it. Sign up on shop.com, become a customer. Let me show you something else that's cool. We've also, at shop.com, we've got uh, a bunch of, on our homepage, we're also a product brokerage company where we have our own products. And if you go on here, we have uh, that, that home survey I had you fill out. You already used 53 products you could now purchase from, from our product brokerage company. And we've got fantastic products. These are not me too products. These are great products that are exclusive. And you can go in here and we can get more information about those later if you're interested. But I just want to show you, that's why we track cons consumer spending. We know people are already buying these products. You personally are using 53 of them already on this list. So let me show you something else that's really cool though. Because remember, the beauty of this is we're not making our money off you. We're making our money off the advertisers and the retail stores that, that, want, that uh, want to drive the traffic to them. So let me just get this up here. We'll go back to the site. So let me show you something else. Travel is another big one. Because I've talked to some people that don't shop a lot online. I don't know, do you, Chris? I don't know if you're big. Okay, you're not a big online shopper. But where do you book your airline and hotel reservations? Uh, usually online. Okay, fair enough. You know, because that's okay. Because I, I didn't used to be a big online shopper either. But we all book our airlines and hotels online. Almost, we almost have to these days, right? So, so that's not uncommon. If you just want to use it for that, that's okay. Again, there's no cost for you to use this. We're partnered with Priceline, Expedia, Hotwire, all the big players. But you'll notice there's a tab up here called Travel. So what's that about? If you click on this, what this is for here for is Travelocity came to us and said, look, we want your customer base. So what we're going to do is create a person, uh, an exclusive site called Shop Travel. It's powered by Travelocity, it's the same platform. So why would you want to use this versus going directly to Travelocity? Well, right off the bat, if you look down here, it shows you're gonna earn between 10% or earn up to 10% cash back on hotels and 4% on vacation packages. Basically, it's cheaper than going directly to Travelocity. So again, just a perk. You sign up as a customer for free, no cost. The reason we can do this is Travelocity wants our millions of customers because what we can do is get like a buying discount. Because have you ever booked out like a block of hotel rooms for a bridal party or something? You get a cheaper rate. Same thing here. We can funnel millions of people to Travelocity and get a cheaper rate. So that's really all. It's so just saving money. Again, you save money, we make money, everybody wins. Win-win situation. 
Another cool thing I like, I love about this, this is a new site we just came up with. We've got this auction site over here. The reason I like this so much, this is different. People are familiar with some of those other auction sites, and you may be those penny bid sites where you got to pay to bid and all that kind of nonsense. This isn't like that. This is a true auction site where, where manufacturers can put things on here, new items, and it doesn't matter what it is, it changes all the time. But remember, here, you're only going to pay if you win the auction and there's no cost to bid, so you can bid on items. And maybe you want to get your wife or significant other some jewelry or something, you can click on this. The neat thing about this is, it doesn't matter if it's a $25 or $100 set of earrings or a $700 iPad. Everything has to start at $1 and there's no reserve. So if you're the only one bidding on it, $1. That's the way it works and that's why we like it so much. What I really love it for is this. Let's say you want to take a family vacation, but money's tight. Because it is these days for a lot of us, right? And you, want, you haven't taken a vacation, but you, would we all like to travel more? Yardley, I, I know me and Yardley would. I would too. Right, okay. So you can go here, click on this travel site. Maybe you've got kids or grandkids like I do, and you want to take them to Florida. There's a million different trips you can take here, but let's, here, here's one, Florida. Orlando, you want to go to Disney. Here's a $2,100 package. The current bid is $46, or $31. To outbid that, you have to bid $46. No way. <laughs> it's true. Here's the thing. People, you, people, I get it. Some people think they're not, this is, these aren't out here. These deals are out here every single day. We want you to find them because, again, we're not making our money off you. We make our money off the retail stores and the advertisers, so you save money. We make money, everybody wins. It's a win-win-win situation. And these hotels will put these deals on here because they, they would rather roll the dice and hope that it bids up than have that, and even if they give it away for $200. Or this, I'll watch these all the time. That'll go, I buy these all the time when I travel with my kids. That'll go for less than 150 bucks. Wow. Yeah. So, seven night, two bedroom stay. I use them all the time. That's a one bedroom, but I've, I've gotten a two bedroom for less than 150 bucks for a week. So again, it's just a way to save money you save money, we make money, everybody wins. And that's really, that's what shop.com is all about. Would you agree you would use a service like this? Absolutely. Okay. There's also a business associated with this, obviously. Would you be interested in learning how this all works, how we make money with this? Yes. Thank you. That's the portal tour. But normally, this is a just so you know, that's how long it takes. 